Welcome to Book of Technical. This video present by Inno91 Green Technologies. This is a touch switch circuit on breadboard. When the touch plate is touched, the small electrical signal from the human body triggers the circuit. The buzzer starts ringing. Every time we touch the plate, the buzzer start ringing, as shown in video. How to make touch switch on breadboard. List of components. Breadboard 1. Small buzzer 1. Transistor BC5471. Resistor 330. Ohm 1. Resistor 10K1. Touch plate module 1. Male female 3. Pin jumper wire 1. Jumper wire 2. Battery connector 1. Battery 9 volt 1. Full list of component. How to use breadboard. Middle gap divided breadboard into two side. Upper side and lower side. Upper side, there are two horizontals point line. 25 points in horizontal line connected to each other. Same second horizontal, 25 points connected to each other. Upper side, there are 30 verticals points line. Five points in vertical line connected to each other. Lower side of breadboard lines, same connection, as same as upper side of breadboard lines. Two horizontals points line and 30 verticals points line. Now you understand the breadboard pins connection and configuration. Build your circuit on breadboard. Important notes for safe and successful making and testing. Always handle it with care and follow safety precautions to avoid burns or accidents. Power supply. Tip. If your circuit does not work and you're using an old battery, replace it with a new battery for reliable power. Component placement. Ensure that all components are properly and firmly inserted into the correct breadboard holes. Loose connections may cause the circuit not working. Step-by-step step instruction. Select transistor BC547. Hold flat part of transistor on your side then shift middle terminal, backside as shown in video. First terminal is collector, second terminal is base, and third terminal is emitter. Insert the transistor pins into the breadboard. Collector terminal. Insert into vertical line number 15 on the lower side. Base terminal. Insert into vertical line number 16 on the upper side. Emitter terminal. Insert into vertical line number 17 on the lower side. Select first jumper wire. Bend jumper wire in U shape as shown in video. Insert one end of the jumper wire into the lower vertical line of the breadboard at line number 17, or any hole in the same vertical line as shown in video. Insert the other end of the jumper wire into a hole in the lower horizontal power rail, near the blue line, which represents the negative rail or ground. Select second jumper wire. Bend jumper wire in U shape as shown in video. Insert one end of the jumper wire into the lower vertical line of the breadboard at line number 15, or any hole in the same vertical line as shown in video. Insert other end of the jumper wire 
into the upper vertical line of the breadboard at line number 10, or any hole in the same vertical line as shown in video. Select small buzzer. Buzzer has two terminals. Long terminal is positive and short terminal is negative as shown in video. Insert the long terminal of buzzer into the upper horizontal row near the red line, positive rail, or the same position as shown in video. Insert the short terminal of buzzer into the upper vertical line number 10, or same upper vertical line of breadboard shown in video. Select 330 ohm resistor. 330 ohm resistor color code is orange, orange, brown, and fourth color is silver or gold. Bend resistor in U shape as shown in video. Insert one end of resistor in upper side of breadboard vertical point line number 16, or same vertical line as shown in video. Insert second end of resistor in upper side of breadboard vertical point line number 21, or same vertical line as shown in video. Select resistor. 10K ohm 10K ohm resistor color code is brown, black, orange, and fourth color is silver or gold. Bend resistor in U shape as shown in video. Insert one end of resistor in upper side of breadboard vertical point line number 21, or same vertical line as shown in video. Insert the other end of the resistor into a hole in the lower horizontal power rail, near the blue line, which represents the negative rail or ground, as shown in video. Select touch plate module and three pin jumper wire ins. Jumper wires are small wires with connectors, pins, on the ends, used to connect different parts of a circuit, especially on breadboards or development boards like Arduino. Insert one end of three pin jumper into touch plate sensor pin, as shown in image. Insert first SIG terminal of touch plate connected through orange wire in upper side of breadboard. Vertical point line number 21, or same vertical line as shown in image. Insert the second VCC terminal of touch plate connected through red wire into the upper horizontal row near the red line, positive rail, or the same position as shown in image. Insert the third GND terminal of touch plate connected through brown wire into the lower horizontal power rail near the blue line, which represents the negative rail or ground. Select connector. Connector, red wire is positive and black wire is negative. Red wire insert in upper side of breadboard horizontal point line indicate near red color line as shown in video. Black wire insert in lower side of breadboard horizontal point line indicate near blue color line as shown in video. Select battery. Battery connect to connector as shown in video. Your touch switch circuit is ready. Let's test the result. When the touch plate is touched, the small electrical signal from the human body triggers the circuit. The buzzer starts ringing. Every time we touch the plate, the buzzer start ringing, as shown in video. Conclusion. The touch switch circuit demonstrates how simple electronic components can create a sensitive and reliable switching system. How to construct the touch switch circuit. Construction of touch switch. Connect the collector terminal of the BC547 transistor to the negative terminal of the buzzer using a jumper wire. Connect the base 
middle pin of the transistor to one end of a 330 ohm resistor. Connect the other end of the 330 ohm resistor to third SIG terminal of touch plate using male to female jumper wire and one end of a 10k ohm resistor. Connect the other end of the 10 k ohm resistor to the negative ground terminal of the battery. Connect the emitter terminal of the transistor to the negative ground terminal of the battery. Connect GND terminal of touch plate using male to female jumper to the negative terminal of the battery. Connect the positive, long terminal of the buzzer to the positive terminal of the battery. Connect VCC terminal of touch plate using male to female jumper to the positive terminal of the battery. And our circuit construction is complete. The project is working perfectly. How to touch switch work. Working of touch switch. Touch plate. Sensor. You connect a small metal plate or wire. This acts as your touch sensor. When you touch the plate, your body provides a tiny amount of voltage or current to the circuit. Base current to transistor. The tiny current flows into the base of the NPN transistor, like BC547. This small base current is enough to turn on the transistor. It works like a switch. Transistor switches on. When the transistor turns on, it allows a larger current to flow from collector to emitter. Buzzer activation. The buzzer is connected in the collector path. When current flows, the buzzer gets power and starts buzzing. The buzzer stays on as long as you keep touching the plate. When touch is removed, once you remove your finger, no current flows into the base. The transistor turns off. The buzzer turns off. That was the working of our circuit. Simple and easy to understand. Component information in details. Breadboard. A breadboard is a plastic board with holes that allows you to plug in and connect electronic components to create an electronic circuit. Small buzzer. A buzzer is an electronic device that makes a buzzing or beeping sound. It's used to alert or notify people and is often found in household appliances, computers and other electronic devices. Transistor BC547 is a bipolar junction, transistor BJT. A transistor is a semiconductor device that amplifies and switches electrical signals. 330 ohm resistor. 330 ohm resistor color code is orange, orange, brown, and fourth color is silver or gold. 10K ohm resistor color code is brown, black, orange, and fourth color is silver or gold. And three pin jumper wire. Jumper wires are small wires with connectors pins on the ends used to connect different parts of a circuit, especially on breadboards or development boards like Arduino. Select touch plate module. Touch switches work by detecting small electrical changes caused by the human body, capacitive or resistive changes. Jumper wire. Jumper wires are simply wires that have connector pins at each end, allowing them to be used to connect two points to each other without soldering. Jumper wires are typically used with breadboards and other prototyping tools in order to make it easy to change a circuit as needed. Battery connector. A battery connector is a device that connects a battery to other devices. Battery. An electric battery is a device that stores chemical energy and converts it to electrical energy. We deliver good and productive video. All video available in Hindi, Marathi and English. Subscribe and get new video. Thank you and visit Book of Technical channel again.